Thank you so much for being here tonight. We are so excited to share some music that we've been working on for the last couple months, throughout the whole year, uh, and where we find ourselves really fortunate to be able to, to meet together um, and just to create some beautiful music and some wonderful memories. Uh, my, my brain is so mush now that I just can't get over how good they are. Uh, so we're going to get into Fan Song, which is uh, from a group called Vida in the 80s and 90s. Kind of a, a call uh, in memory of the Sudanese basket weavers during the, the big famines that happened throughout Africa, throughout Sudan uh, in the early 80s that also inspired uh, War of the World. So uh, this song features several soloists. Uh, we've got uh, Taylor Brook and Lily Wilson. Adam Holbrook, Jennifer Bear Tusk, and then a, a solo duet with Acacia Jones and Grace Skiles, and a solo band.
one song in the world for a living. Or at least I think it's fun. Uh, so we're moving into Lament for a Lost Child, uh, which is kind of a funky tune. Uh, it's not really a tune. It's uh, kind of a plan, if you haven't read the program notes uh, in, in the program, it's uh, kind of a play on what sounds and movements and visuals uh, a lost child might have. You know, like thinking about if you see a kid walking around in a park, and they can't quite remember where they were supposed to meet their little brother. Or they weren't quite sure where the heck they were supposed to meet up with mom and dad. This is a play on that. So uh, one of the coolest things about this, and one of the reasons it was chosen for this concert, uh, it is notated that the music, the sheet music itself, is not normal sheet music. It has some notes, it has something written, but it's a completely different style of notation. So when you go home today, ask your singer to see the music. And then compare that to like a French piece or Phantom Song or another one of their, their uh, pieces of music. It looks completely different. And that aids in what happens here. So here's Lament for a Lost Child.
So, awesome job. Hi, Supreme. We want to thank you again for joining us in this evening of music. Just so much fun to get to make music with, with these uh, human beings. They're such a fun time. And when I'm at my wits end, I know that if Varsity shows up, I'll probably be better by the end of the day. So, they're really fun. Thank you for having a hand in raising such wonderful human beings. It's really, really an honor to get to work with them every other week. Uh, a couple thank yous before we start our last piece. First of all, Suzanne Purdy at the piano. Just the arts and music in general. We're, we're really fortunate to have that. So thank you, admin team. We have also a really strong group of music educators and uh, music professionals in this building. We're really, really cool to get to work with them, especially Diana Jones, our music secretary. Without her, we'd all just run around and chicken our head cut off. So thank you so much, Diana. Bring a chair, bring a blanket, bring some cash to buy some concessions. Pops concerts will be a great time. All of the choirs will be together. It'll be just a super fun outdoor excursion. And who knows what's going to happen with the weather. We play it right here. Um, the concert's been recorded and be posted on YouTube here in a couple days. Um, our last song, Go Right Send Me, guest soloist, Will Pops. Uh, we're going to let him go and take off his mask. It's a huge solo. We want him to really be able to feel like he's digging into it. So here's Andre Thomas's Go Right Send Me. Thank you for sharing this evening with you. Yeah. 